At this time last year, we were preparing to release a movie that you may have seen, or I hope you've seen, uh, God's Not Dead. Fill in the papers I've just given you with three little words. God is dead. I can't do what you want, I'm a Christian. With no God, there's no real reason to be moral. I will make it my personal mission to destroy any hope of a lot of in your future. There is a God, and yet I'm him. God does not exist. Everything is permissible. I think I have cancer. This couldn't wait until tomorrow. I hate God! I don't know Jesus. Uh, it's a gift. Uh, as a God that you don't believe in has given you another chance. Uh, another chance to change your final answer. <laughs> yes, I. Right. What happened here tonight is a cause for celebration. And click on everybody you know and text them. Three simple words. God's not dead. And we were so amazed and blessed by how God has used this film to impact people's hearts to make God's Not Dead the surprise hit movie of 2014 validated the existence of God. What comes next after you fully understand who God is? There's a gang storyline which brings a certain edge to the movie. The only way out you're ever going to find is right in there. Listen to me. You come to the cross by way of repentance. I'll change my ways, I promise. Just please save me right now. He's a pastor, played by Ted McGinley who's confronted by a street preacher, played by Delroy Lindo. And if you believe, then the question is, what are you going to do about it? There's an EMT who gets in legal trouble for sharing his faith. If what I did has suddenly become a crime, then I'm proud to plead guilty. I shared my faith with a dying man, a man who was only looking for comfort. It's something I've done for years, only no one's ever cared about it until now. I was once asked if you were ever accused of being a Christian, would there be enough evidence to convict you? Off the record, I don't really care. I am going to take you for everything you own. It's about money. There's one thing that you should know if you don't already. This cross, it's going to cost you. It is the way, it is the truth. Do you believe?